Pradhanmantri Garib Kalyan Anna Yojana has been critical in preventing any increase in extreme poverty levels in India during the COVID-19 as per study by the International Monetary Fund. As per the report, extreme poverty in India was less than 1% in 2019 and it remained same even during 2020. Recently, keeping with the concern and sensitivity towards poor and vulnerable sections of society, Pradhan Mantri Garib Kalyan Anna Yojana has been extended by the Union Cabinet till September 2022. Under this scheme, government announced the distribution of additional free of cost food grains to about 80 crore National Food Security Act beneficiaries. Since then, it has been critical in preventing any increase in extreme poverty levels in India. The scheme entails providing 5 kg food grains per person per month over and above the regular monthly food grains under NFSA, thereby doubling the food entitlements. The benefit is being provided to beneficiaries under National Food Security Act and direct benefit transfer. The report stated that pandemic shock is largely a temporary income shock and that temporary fiscal policy interventions have been fiscally appropriate to absorb a large part of it. An important determinant of poverty consumption growth was also found to be higher in 2014-19 than in 2004 to 2011. This has been made possible due to the highest ever food grain procurement and highest ever payment to farmers by the government despite the century's worst pandemic. It clearly illustrates the raw business of India's social safety architecture as India withstood one of the world's biggest exogenous income shocks.